Hey guys, uh, this is Normal for Technique.com, and today we'll see how to install the latest uh, Black Update from Nokia. So Nokia had announced the Black Update uh, back in Abu Dhabi, the Nokia World, and the first device to feature this update was the Nokia Lumia 1520, and then followed by Lumia 1320, as well as the latest Nokia Lumia 525. So all these devices had uh, the Nokia Lumia Black Update. Now Nokia has announced that the black update will be rolled out to other devices as well and in the first slot uh, Nokia Lumia 925 and Lumia 1020 were covered and the update was released for these two devices and Nokia said that uh, the update will be rolled out for the other devices like 920, 820, 720, 620, 625 and 520. So all the devices will feature this update. So this update has been already rolled out for Nokia Lumia 920 as well. So we'll see how to update to the latest Nokia Black update on your Windows Phone A device. So before that, let's have a quick look at uh, what's new in the Black update. So first up is the Nokia app folder, so it allows you to quickly uh, create folders. Then there is uh, Nokia Glance Screen 2.0, Nokia Refocus app. Then there is Nokia Beamer as well. We have covered this Beamer app on a separate video on our timeline. Then there is Nokia Storyteller, Nokia Camera, which uh, uh, integrates uh, both ProCam as well as um, uh, SmartCam. Then there is also Road DNG support for 1020 and 1520. So let's see how to update uh, uh, the device. So for that, uh, let's first start. Uh, uh, let's uh, get the connect the device to internet and then. Uh, open the settings so let's uh, go ahead and see how to update uh, the Nokia Lumia into the latest uh, black update so this uh, black update will be rolled out uh, to certain regions so you need to check for settings so let's open settings and then um, go ahead and uh, see phone updates so let's uh, open phone updates so there you go the phone updates so select that phone update right now you can see the there is a update available and it's ready for download but in case you're not seeing it there is there will be an option check for updates so you need to hit the check for update button and it will connect to the internet and see if there is an, an update available for download so right now since we have already have the update we'll start the download process so let's uh, start the download process right here so you need to connect to the internet to start the download process so uh, you need a Wi-Fi connection, so let's uh, get started with download. So you can see here it's uh, just starting to download. So the update is uh, pretty huge, so you need to have a Wi-Fi connection to download the update. So unless you have your connected to Wi-Fi connection, so let's go ahead and connect to a Wi-Fi network. So there you go. We're just uh, switching on the Wi-Fi and connecting to our uh, Wi-Fi connection. So it's already connecting. So there you go, we'll uh, go, ahead, go back to the update. So right now it's uh, starting to download the update. So it will take some time based on uh, the size of the update. So we'll wait for it to finish the download process. So now the update is uh, downloaded and you can see update is ready to install. So show details. Um, so it says uh, Nokia update for Windows Phone. So this is the update uh, ready to install. So right now we'll click the install button. Then the phone will restart and uh, uh, start the update process. So this again will take some time based on uh, the, the, uh, the phone and the, the, the amount of update available. So it's restarting the phone. Now let's uh, wait for it to finish the update. So now you can see the Windows Phone gears icon indicating that the update process has been started. So this will take some time depending about the update size and your phone. So right now we'll wait for it to finish uh, the installation process. So now the update is uh, being uh, done by the phone. Okay, now the uh, update has been installed. Now it's the migration process. So you can see step uh, three of six, uh, migrating your data. So this will take another couple of minutes uh, before the final uh, step is complete and your phone will be uh, usable. 
so now the update is uh, complete and you can get the message your update is all done so all the migration process all completed and now you will have the uh, nokia lumia black update so there you go the lumia black update now you can just to confirm that uh, it's uh, just black update just go to settings so now the restart process is complete so if you go to settings and extras plus info you will see the nokia black update uh, you can see nokia black uh, i mean the lumia black update so this uh, lumia win 920 comes now right now has uh, the black update so that's all the process uh, it's uh, a bit time consuming based on the device you have and the update size for the device so this is uh, how you do the update and uh, you will be having the Nokia Lumia update or um, Lumia update with all the new features. So this has been right now rolled out for 925, 920 as well as 1020. So the rest of the devices you'll have to wait uh, once till the time Nokia announces uh, or releases the update. So that's all guys. Uh, thanks for watching the video and don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel for all the latest updates. And uh, we'll, if you have any queries, uh, drop a comment and we'll be glad to help you out. Thanks for watching the video.